Hi there! In this video, I'm going to show you the new feature on Wix. That is the online program, how to build online courses on Wix website. There are two ways to go. If you don't have the uh, Wix website yet, and of course, as usual, you go to the templates on Wix sites and you just search on online course. And there are quite a lot of different templates they have built already for the online courses now. And it is going to be the exact same as I'm going to show you how to add on the online program, online courses to your existing website. So now I'm going to uh, existing website. We choose any uh, Wix website or template on Wix. For example, this one. This is just a simple uh, CV website. And uh, now I'm going to show you how to add on the online courses. And uh, for the editing, for the changing, for everything, I'm going to show you exactly the same when you are uh, having the uh, template one on Wix program. Okay, so now if you have a Wix website already, and you can go directly to add on here, and see there are some uh, uh, options here for the uh, other apps, but you cannot see on the online programs, and uh, you have to go to the uh, uh, app store here. In App Store, you are going to find the online programs directly here. And if you can now see this way, you can just go here and write online program. And you see here, this is called a Wix online programs. You go there and you add to your set. Okay. And it's very straightforward and very easy to use. And exactly the same when you are adding on your booking system on the website. Uh, in Wix, you, they are going to have a, a single page for these programs. This is going to be a new page here. You see, this is the one, the create page for uh, the programs. And then if you see, if you move here, this one up a little bit, and you can see here, it, they call it projects. And since this is a CV uh, website, they call it projects. But if this is a coaching project, they might name it like uh, programs. So it does not matter. So this is the page they have added on. It's called programs. And how to edit it? So first, you click on this one. And you go to here for the manager programs here. And you will see how it look like uh, behind the scenes. and. Uh, as a usual, as a, as usual, you can always go to your dashboard and go to the sidebars, and you will see here on the uh, information about the online programs. Here, see, this is the programs. Okay, so then they have the steps to step instructions. So, what do you want to create? A long line course, a fitness fitness challenge, personal coaching, or a start fresh everything. So we can just choose one of these uh, template online courses. Then you go next. And start from fresh or use some template. We can usually it always work good if you have the uh, template to use, and then you can just always change the uh, the content and pictures. For example, this one we choose this one: how to create a business plan. Finish. So now you can see the all the information is here. This is the basic uh, program details, and this is the content and. Uh, the thing is, uh, you have to learn is that they call uh, each lesson as a step, and they call each section of this as uh, no matter it's called chapter or things. And this area is called is a section, and each of the lessons under is the uh, uh, lessons, and then it's called a step. So the things you need to do the updating is that you go to the program details, do the editing for the basic information and all the prices, scheduling and grid badge. And basic information is just about the name and descriptions and the categories and picture, of course. And then if you go back to the uh, other settings and you will do the pricing is also you can have the uh, private public or secret and from free or pay to join you can have set up the price 
and even have the pricing plan for it for the subscriptions. And you also you can limit it to your participants or not. Okay, and then after this pricing, uh, after this pricing settings, and the next step is to the scheduling. Scheduling is more like um, uh, how long time they're going to have this program. Sometimes people have like a twenty days challenge or seven days challenge. Then you can have a setting. For example, here you can write maybe seven days challenge, something like that. And then they can either do any order or they have to. How to fix order? Lesson one, lesson two, lesson three.、Mm -hmm. Okay, then you can have this one. Be set it up already, and then after you finish this one, you can see you can have the reward for it. If you do the reward for it, you can create a badge for them, and also you can create a group for these people. Or if all of the people register on the same courses, they have in their member portal, they can have a discussion about the topics, everything. So they have a group. Talk with each other, so you can maintain a good community on it. And then, after all of this, and the most important, I want to remind you is that、uh, you can always set up your、uh, notifications for the uh, 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 their uh, courses. For example, you want to have remind them, okay, today is going to do this lesson or something like that. You can always customize here. Title, message, and show the steps. And here, you see here. Hi there. You have steps to complete how to create this plan. And then the the、uh, customer is going to click on it, and then they go to the course directly. And there, of course, you have the program ended and how steps completed for like、uh, keeping track on the、uh, students' progress on it. And after this one. And、uh, one small tips for you is that if since many people have only maybe only one program, but、uh, a lot of people have different programs, different online courses. If you want to send them directly to the course itself, is not like a whole program, how all different packages. You can actually find、uh, your URL here and copy this one, send to people or share、uh, to the people and add on the pictures of itself. Okay, so then that is the basic setting for the、uh, programs, and now it's time to do the uh, uh, lessons. The the lessons,、uh, the content for your、uh, products, you can do two things. One is to add the section that I was talking about. This is like a chapters or modules. It's called section. If you go to the section. And you click on it, and see here you can add a picture on it, and you can have a name. We can see like、uh, coming soon. For example, if、uh, you have a section like at the end of the modules, and you want、uh, to wait a bit until people finish everything, and then come to this one, and you can also decide on the drippings on it. That means, for example, people has to finish the first four weeks program, then come to the fifth week, something like that. And then you can do do the um uh day one, day two, day three to be able to show this content. Otherwise, you can just turn it off or keep it coming soon like this. And when you're ready with this content, you can turn it on when it's ready. Okay, so then you see this coming soon is here. And the, all of these lessons is called the staff. And for example, this one, if you go click on this template here, you can see here. Add it. So this is the how your lesson look like. You have the title, you have contents of your lesson, and you can also add the videos here. And you can you can up upload the video if you have it on computer or the link, and you can also upload a worksheet or yeah, any material you want people to download, and you can add add on the file there. You can also add a questionnaire. And you can also add a quiz on it, so maintain the interaction with your students. Okay, and of course you can put in which section you want. Okay, now we can save it. So that is the basic uh, uh all the settings for your program. Okay, and when everything is ready, you can publish it, and、uh, then people can just join directly there. And then when it's、uh, come to the uh program itself. You can see behind this one. You can see all the progress you have. This is the one we just created, and this is going to show here. And if you want to have more programs, go here, click on new, and this is the same process as before. 
But if another uh, thing is that if you want to do very similar uh, structure as this one, the first one, you can always click on here and duplicate this one. And in this way, the good thing is that they do the same, exact the same settings as the uh, before, so you might save time and energy on it. So this is the draft one, not published yet, and this is the one published. So we can do um, uh, this draft one for like this, publish. Then you can see there are two programs there already. And uh, you see, this is uh, both are active now. And uh, the new one, we might have a small change on the name, so we can distinguish them when we go through the uh, uh, website. So this is uh, uh, what to do, something like that. And then we can just save it. We don't spend time on changing pictures. It's, it's straightforward. OK, after setting, we do uh, turning off this one. And uh, you see on your website, it's going to show two programs. That's right, what to do and how to create a business plan. And if you want to do the design for it, and go straight to the settings here. The settings, you can do the layout, you can do something like this, and something like this, you can do decide whatever you want yeah, to do. And of course, you can do the um, uh, how it look like on pictures. You can have a round one, a square one, and both are fine. And uh, you can also go to the display. You can decide whether you want to show the pictures or not. You want to hide pictures, you can just click, for, like, uh, click away this image and uh, even click away this um, uh, press also. So you can just make it as simple as possible if you want. And uh, the text is uh, uh, way straightforward. You just go click the one and change the name on it and all the buttons, text, and designs, all of these uh, colors and uh, uh, names on it. And you can just click on an each change of each for the design part as usual when you are doing for the Wix website. Okay, so now it is done for the editing for it. Now we are in the preview mode. So we're going to see how it looks like if people click on the join. Okay, so we click on this one. We'll see how it looks like after uh, we click on this button. And uh, it is going to show you like this. So the title and how many licenses and uh, join the button and pictures and the information about the lessons and the price of course and join and all of these are going to be shown on our website and there is uh, if you have the settings for your uh, lessons they're going to have a list on your lessons here also when you are out, when you have done the updating on the uh, mm, lessons okay so that is all how do you publish uh, online courses on Wix and uh, it is called online program on the you know, VIX website from the App Store there. Okay, and uh, good luck and hopefully this video helps you to build a better VIX website. Thank you.